Hey YouTubers. Well, today we're gonna break down a, a air terminal vent. Um, this thing got the most valuable part in here is the is the copper radiator. Um, these things go for about maybe a dollar fifty a pound maybe less at this time they may be going for a dollar ten fifteen depending on your supplier but uh, today we're just gonna break one of these down and take all of the copper off and inside of here there's uh, really nothing else but a few wires inside this box. Let's see which one we gotta use. Gotta use a smaller one. Tiny. Tiny. Yeah, these things. You yeah, ain't not gonna make much off of them, but if you have a whole lot of them, you get them out of an industrial place, industrial industrial warehouse. I got about four of them, and they range in sizes. I do have a bigger one than this one, and a smaller one. This is much more of a medium size. Terminal vent, but the most valuable part, like I said, is the copper radiator in these things, and it don't take long to break these down. If you had a proper tool, as you can see, just a small little board inside. Let me get a closer look at it. There's some wires. So, pretty much you just get the wires cut, yank the board out, and what I'm going to do is cut this off, save the copper, pull the radiator out, and we'll see what we have from there. Yep, so, just find my snip snips. Always remember to have your safety gloves on with some safety glasses. So, just grab this, pop them, just cut, cut and pop. Or if you got the sawzall, some electronic tools, here you go, piece of copper. Gotta always save the copper. Keep some pliers handy. And pretty much just stack these things, you know. Always try to save your copper radiators because you take them in, you get over 100 pounds, then it's worth it. So. Air conditioners got even heavier ones. In cars, you can certain vehicles, trucks, older models. You can find even some brass radiators inside of those things. There you go, nice piece of copper. Pop this thing on. Cut that thing off later. So you just pretty much follow that technique. Next side, and then you start the same thing on this side. Just cut it. Be a flat head. 
So when it's time to pry it out, it'll come out much more easier. But each one weighs pretty good. And you get enough of these babies, you'll possibly have a uh, man, nice amount of money. But it just depends on how many of these copper radiators you have. As you can see this aluminum and the copper runs right through it. But you also have to have someone who's HVAC certified um, to take the Freon out of these things. Uh, but there's no compressor present with these. But, um, because they disconnect from the vent ventilation system. That's uh, pretty much on the ceilings inside of a warehouse or a building of some sort. But um, just stock up, stockpile, and make big bucks. Thank you for watching. Uh, like, subscribe, and comment.